Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardo. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said the cognac, ooh, ooh. I said the cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm a bubbly blonde, fabulously dressed to impress. One of a kind girl. I was brought into this world wrapped up in pearls. I love to mingle, though my husband reminds me I'm not single. I meet and greet both the famous and the elite. I ride in limousines drinking the finest champagne, wearing first dazzling diamond jewelry. A girl can't complain. I live in upscale. Dining in the finest restaurants, eating the best caviar for free. And no matter how much. How are you all? We're here in the Hamptons having fun. We're here at the Araya, and it's all about a pool party and an art show. And I'm here with one of the fabulous artists who's showcasing his work. Introduce yourself to the camera. My name is C.D. Love. C.D. Love. C. Love. C. Love. Yes. Now tell us about your paintings. First of all, how many paintings do you have here exhibiting? I have three. Three paintings. Yes. Now, how did you find out about this event today? Um, my uncle is, his company is one of the sponsors. Oh, he's the production yes, guy, yeah, yeah, uh, yes. Brown. Yes. I just Linda interviewed Brown. him. Okay, yes. He must be so proud of you yes. for him to sponsor this event today. Yes. Yes. Has this been your dream your whole life to be an artist? Uh, well, at, when, I was in, when I was in college, I wanted to be a marine biologist and... I didn't like chemistry, so I decided to be an artist instead. But I always, I've always done art since I was about 15, and sounds like me. I always did art too. Yeah, I've always done art, music. I always, always had done like music. an artistic mind yeah, and yeah. wanted to create, yeah. either act or be in film or television. Yeah, I've done some acting. I've done some plays also. So, I, so yeah. I've always, that's always been in my blood. It's yeah. in our DNA, yeah, darling. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Yes. <laughs> It's probably we have relatives back in the yes. day, you well, know, ancestors I know, I know. that were artists. My great grandfather on my father's side was a basket weaver, and that's how he made his money. So yeah, so it, it's that, and then all his sons are cabinet makers and carpenters. So it it, it, it passes down the line. Of, I got it from my father. Were you lousy in chemistry? I hated chemistry. I hated it with a passion. Yeah, me too. I hated it too. Yeah. Math and chemistry is not my yeah, cup yeah. of tea. Yeah, History uh, and anthropology, the yeah. study of mankind and yeah. his environment, yes, I, that's exactly what I like. Thing, I did biology for a while. I, I was... I was going. I was. I was there. Just the chemistry kind of stumbled me up, and then I love art. I've been making art since I was little, so I said, "Let me just tell stay us there. about your art. What kind of art? Um, is it well, a special type of art? Is it, it is, surrealism? It's like is it's, it abstract? It's, it's surrealism because it's uh, it's surrealism because I, I have realistic images of portraits of people in there, but there's um, abstract elements. So there's. If you, if you see it, there's butterflies where they're not really supposed to be and flowers where they're not supposed to be. So it's surrealist. Yeah, it's a surrealistic thing. I'm, my, my specialty is the human form, so portraits. I like to do a lot of portraits, but I usually do a little spin on them. And I add an element of um, screen printing. So I start with this. 
I start off by painting the background and then I add a screen print and then I paint on top of that whatever image I feel like fits sounds that image. fabulous sounds fabulous now um, where will you be showing your art next is there a specific place are you showing it in a gallery next that no, we should I, know about I don't have anything set up right now um, I'm also a musician so I, I have some shows set up in DC where I'm from but there's nothing art wise set up right now I work on that yes, I will. tell my audience is this your first time here in the Hamptons? This is my first time in the Hamptons. What do you think of the Hamptons, it, darling? It feels like I'm on the islands. I love the, I love the end of weather. It's beautiful. The sun is really strong. I'm going to tell you, artists come to the Hamptons because of the light. Yeah, it's the just, the yeah. lighting here is amazing. Yeah. Yes, yes, you know how many so artists strong. I've, I've, I've interviewed that all tell me here in the Hamptons the lighting is the most beautiful yes. lighting they've ever seen. Yes, it feels like I'm on, actually feels like I'm in the Caribbean a little bit. If it was just a little warmer, I would feel like I was in the Caribbean. The sun is so strong and prominent and beautiful. Yeah, I really enjoy it. Can we follow you? Do you have a website? Do you have I an Instagram? Have a, I have a website. My Instagram is c.loveC, A-B-C-D-O-T, L-O-V-E, c.love. Um, my website is C Love Artistry, www.cloveartistry. That's where you can follow me. Find me. Gorgeous. Give me a kiss. <laughs> and we'll be back in a moment with more interviews right here in the Hamptons. Right, Keep watching. You. Peace, champagne, kisses. Welcome back, darlings. I'm Cognac with Elaine. We're here at the Araya, and it's all about the art and a fabulous pool party. And I'm here with one of the artists, Ben Moon. So Ben, I was taking a look at some of your artwork. Absolutely gorgeous. Tell my audience what the inspiration for those paintings is all about. Well, thanks so much. It's uh, always great to see you. When, when you're here, I know it's a good event, so. That's true. <laughs> um, you know, this piece, uh, I spent a lot of time this summer kind of just working on a lot of collage and found elements and stuff that's affected me kind of in my life. And uh, I, I think of it like a tapestry. It's like weaving together a lot of little pieces of information that basically have had an effect on my life and affected me emotionally or made me think about stuff. So there's a biographical element to this piece. So it's just made of lots of little pieces of information that sort of affected me in my life. What, three paintings today, or there's more than that? There's one large painting, and then there's a, a surfboard, a, a commissioned surfboard that I painted for somebody. Wow. So that's going to go at a, a new boutique called Unicorn Laughs. Where is that? That is, uh, it's going to be in, in the Lower East Side, but uh, the surfboard's over, over there, so we can go check it out later. I'm going to check it out. So tell me, you've been here before in the Hamptons. Why do you love the Hamptons so much? I mean, I just think it's a, it's an amazing place. You know, I my family is from Long Island, so it's very familiar to me. Really? Where in Long Island are they? Uh, Old Westbury, actually. So yeah, it's great to get out of the city, and you feel like you're just on a vacation somewhere in another world. But really, it's not too far away, and uh, you know, great people, beautiful scenery, and just a great place to do art and be creative. I can totally see why so many of the famous artists moved out here to do their work, like Jackson Pollock. I was just saying, the, art, the lighting here in the Hamptons is just beautiful. Oh, you can't beat it. The light, the air, something about it, it's just very, it spurs creativity. Absolutely. Tell my audience, where could we go to find out more about you? Are you showing any of your artwork in a gallery later? Will, that be, will we see any of it in a gallery? I'm going to have a, a show coming up on September 9th at a very cool new place, uh, Soho Inc. it's called. So that opened up in Soho. It's a really cool like high-end tattoo shop. So they have amazing artwork there. They've got a big Harley Davidson in the front window. So that, that opening is uh, September 12th, actually. It's right during Fashion Week. Yep, so it's going to be coordinated with Fashion Week. And uh, yeah, uh, a lot of stuff all over the city. And um, just, yeah, our, I do music also. So our band Black Lights plays uh, all around. We're playing at the Pyramid Club on the 9th. So we'll be all around the Lower East Side, basically. Sounds like a lot of fun. Tell us where can
can we follow you? Do you have a website? Do you have an Instagram? You can see what I'm up to at worldofbenmoon.com. And uh, also, I do a lot of events with Jody Bisasor, who did this amazing party. And she's at Exquisite Events NY. Fabulous job today. She Fabulous. Always, yeah, she always just does a great job. So whenever I'm doing something with her, I know I'm in good hands. So, uh, yeah, you can see it there. Um, yeah, worldofbenmoon.com basically has everything Ben Moon. Gorgeous. Give me a kiss, darling. Ah. We'll be back in a moment, darlings. More interviews in the Hamptons. Keep watching. Pink Champagne Kisses. Welcome back, darlings. I'm Cognac Will Elaine. We're here at the Araya for a sexy art pool party. And I'm talking to one of the famous artist Marcus Glitteri so who sweet is of you. showing his artwork so it's really you. amazing Marcus tell my yes. audience uh, keep us up to date now what have you been doing in the past year you've been working on some projects Miss Conan first of all I want to say thank you so much for coming back it's a year later and we were, you were so gracious enough to come back to us we loved your presence here last year it's a year later it's a year more of art shows a year more paintings well, today we're doing a pool party here. I have a little prop. Today we're doing an auction, Miss Cognac. Maybe, um, maybe we could put some bids in for some nice, affordable paintings. We're trying to sell art these days. Why buy five thousand dollar paintings when you could just buy five hundred dollar paintings? Why not buy paint for five hundred dollars? Buy art, people. Buy art. So today is about selling art. It's about buying art. It's about buying making art. Affordable art. Affordable art. Affordable art. That's why we're here. So, how has your year been? My year has been crazy, but I'm blessed. I'm lucky, I'm very blessed. I do a lot of TV shows, oh, I interview a lot of celebrities, I'm always Cognac. doing I, things. I'm and so you're inspired one of the, by you. You're one I'm, of the people I love you know, I'm to so interview. I'm so inspired by you. Now, Ms. Cognac, do you know what this is? No, For the audience, um, I don't want to poke fun, but we're not Sotheby's, but we are going to have our own little auction prop. So, when you're at the auction, they go, you, $500. Can I get $600? You, $600. So this is going to be our prop today. I think it's fun. It's actually something that we'll recycle. it's gorgeous. Isn't it beautiful? It's beautiful like I you. Do this on my so phone. I would love to do this on you. I could definitely do something famous called that. Isn't that beautiful? So cool. I think it's beautiful. I think you are beautiful. And I think you're beautiful. I want you to tell Ready? me. Ready? Ready? Give me your hand. Welcome back, darlings. I'm Cognac Will Elaine. I'm here with artist Asia Lee, and we're here at the Araya for a sexy pool, art pool party. And she came by to talk about the art and to talk about the Hamptons and to why she likes this event so much, why you are such a big supporter of this event. Oh, I'm a huge supporter of the arts and um, our own creativity. We're meant to create. We are constantly creating our own lives, and the art is just an expression of our creativity. Yes, and you brought uh, this amazing painting. Tell my audience, it's beautiful, the light, it, it, the blue, it's, the colors are gorgeous. What was the inspiration for this particular painting that you showed, you actually showed me just now? I, I dreamt of it. I was kept dreaming about this cellular painting, and I couldn't get it out of my head. And finally, I decided to create. It. And I needed to learn a new technique, so I stayed up for days, um, YouTubing and trying to figure out how to create the cells in the I image. Um, and my first one was so bad I just scraped all the paint off and then I just I made five pieces once I got on a row and it really goes to the core of what I am who I am which is I'm always about love and happiness and healing I'm Reiki certified the alternative healing and it's about just spreading this love and healing and that's what the um, title is it's the whole series is called oceans and it's the beautiful ocean theme and colors yes, and that's what it reminded me of the ocean beautiful mm -hmm, the waves and then the cells are healing at a cellular level you know we want to heal everyone's searching how to heal we do all this on a superficial level but the deep healing has to come on the deep subconscious cellular level for us to really change and change our belief system that 
we are whole, we are beautiful, and we are enough. We are enough. Very, very wise words. We are enough. You hear that, guys? We are enough. So important. Now, uh, this is pretty much the end of the summer, right? This is. No. Oh, no. Yes, it yeah. is. The Hampton Classic closes I the know. end of the summer. We still have a full week. We still have a whole and week. And is Fashion Week. Yes, yes. Well, I see you at Fashion Week. Yes, well, yes. What shows will you be going to? Um, I often go to Zhang Tua, which I... Yeah, me of Zhang Tua, I'll be yes. I, I, I love him. Is that how you say it? Zhang Tua? Tua? Um, you know what? It's... If I have a terrible accent, so <laughs> don't go, don't go by me. <laughs> I call him Zang Toy. I call him Zang, baby Zang. You know what? All the boys are toys for you. <laughs> yes, all the boys, all the all the boys are toys for me. That's for sure. That's for sure. Well, you are a delight always to talk to, and your paintings are beautiful, and your inspirations are so inspiring for other artists as well as yourself. You are a true artist, and uh, and you, you devote your life to healing, and that's important. Tell my audience, where can we go to learn more information about your art? AsiaLeeFineArt.com You're just gorgeous. Give me a kiss. Always. Take a picture, dog. We'll be back in a moment, darling. Some more interviews coming up. Keep watching. Pick champagne kisses. Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardell. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. Crybaby Productions, darlings.